hi guys how are you all doing today so today i'm gonna be sharing a quick message so contrary to what many people would assume or what many people would think i actually do not remember things as much as i would like to so that means even when i study for exams there are so many things i study and at the end of the day there are sort of things things that I may be read like I read for like a very long time that I don't remember. And I feel like, you know, that happens to everybody, but I've kind of noticed over the years that maybe something else is going on. So I'm just going to tell like a quick story. When I was in secondary school, that's what people would call high school in America. I stayed with my sister in the dorm. So... It was a boarding house, which means that we didn't like go home and go. We, we the school was our home, and to date, I do not have any memories of me and my sister living together in the same room. It's that bad. There are so many things that have happened, and people will be like, "Oh yes, Rahima, you were there. <laughs> Come tell your side of the story." And honestly. It's not been funny, honestly, like this has really, really cost me a lot because I just don't remember things. And it's not like, it's not like I'm doing it for fun or anything, but that's just the way it is. And I once had an exam where I read for like months and I was literally in the exam hall, I had the paper in front of me and I remembered nothing. I'm not even joking. Nothing. The whole thing. It was like someone deleted the file. <laughs> and I couldn't remember anything. And it was really sad because I didn't do well in the exam. So, but I don't know how I go through school with that problem. It's huge for me. It's, it's a big deal for me because I know how sometimes it kind of, it, it causes a lot of trouble. So, the reason why I'm telling this story is you don't have to be perfect to get things done. You see other people and feel that oh, they are perfect and they are amazing and their journey is wonderful and so smooth, but you never know what people are going through. So regardless of the deficiencies, quote and unquote, because sometimes these things are strength and we don't know. Because if something bad happens, that means I probably would not remember for a long time or the file would just get deleted, like any other thing. So it doesn't matter what that thing is that you feel you don't have and every other person seems to have. It can be amazing. It can do wonderful things. You can shatter barriers and break them and smash them. You don't have to wait till you know you are like everybody you see you cannot be like anyone you are unique you have you make you that's just it so i i see so many people comparing themselves to other people and they also feel that if so many people are doing it already why would i be different like what's the point there is a point and you had a point so to round up this message today you are amazing you are doing a wonderful job and if there's anything at all you really love and you would want to do i don't want you to keep creating this fence and carving this you know box for yourself a box that is non-existent so this is my message for you today and i hope you have a wonderful day see you in my next video Bye bye